Hello everyone, welcome to the C Sharp tutorials section of our channel, please don't forget to subscribe and click the notification bell to receive free updates. This lesson is all about the decision control structures in C Sharp, specifically the nested if statement. The lesson includes sample programs to better understand how nested if statement works in C Sharp. By the end of this lesson, students should be able to 1. Demonstrate essential understanding on the nested if statement. 2. Create a program that implements the concept of nested if statement. 3. Solve problems using the concept of nested if statement in C Sharp. A nested if statement is one in which one if statement is nested within another if statement. This allows you to test multiple conditions and take different actions depending on the results of the tests. Nested if statements are often used to create complex conditional logic. Line 1 We usually utilize the using keyword to add namespaces. Then, in the current page, it makes all of the classes, interfaces, and abstract classes, as well as their methods and properties, available. Console is a method or member function inside the namespace of system. We need to add it on the first line of our program since we need the console method to display and read user inputs. Line 2. The name of the program is c -sharp nested if statement. Line 6. Main method is the entry point of all c -sharp programs. Line 8. Variable declaration, user input is the variable name of string type. It simply means that the variable can accept alphanumeric values. Line 9. Another variable has been declared, passcode is the variable name of string type. Line 10. This line will display the text enter name. Line 11. Console.readLine takes the value entered and stores it in the user input variable that we have declared in line 8. Line 13. This is the start of if statement. It is where the conditional statement is being evaluated. Line 19 to 24. This is the nested if statement. This block of code will be executed if the condition of line 13 returns true. It means that the nested statements will run if the value entered by the user is equal to John. Line 19. The nested if statement is also a conditional statement to be tested. Line 21. This line will be executed if the statement in line 19 returns true. It means that if the user has entered 1234, the console will display access granted. Line 24. This line will be executed if the condition in line 19 returns false. It means that the user has not entered the value of 1234. The console will display access denied. Line 26. This is where the program will jump if the condition in line 13 returns false. It means that the user has not entered John. Line 27. This is the line that will be executed if line 13 is false. The console will display a text invalid name. Line 28. The purpose of this line is to prevent the console from closing unless the user will press a key in the keyboard. Watch the video for the demonstration.
Thank you for watching. For more tutorials on C Sharp, please like, share, and subscribe to your channel. Happy coding!